We live in a cottage craftsman home in Sausalito and it was a thousand square feet. And my husband had his own office and I found myself with my laptop sitting in the living room. All my stuff was in the dining room table and then we'd you know, want to sit down for dinner and I was constantly shuffling around and I said this isn't going to do. A friend of mine actually, we were uh, gardening in the backyard and she said, you know, that spot right there, you could have a really great little shed. This would be great. I could have a fey cave, just like a guy, but I could have my own little space where I could come to and do whatever I wanted to do when I needed to do it. And I have a beautiful view of Richardson Bay and I just I love it out here. <laughs> it's the California living experience where we're bringing the outside in and the idea was to integrate the home with the Fay Cave. And so from our kitchen you'll be able to walk out into a deck and there will be a pathway to the shed and then from the shed we're going to have a wraparound porch there will be steps down into what will be an edible garden and through that edible garden you'll be able to walk back up a flight of steps into the house and so this way we're, we're having a complete circle connection between the house and the shed. We actually originally were looking at one of your competitors buildings and I didn't like it. I didn't like the the look or the feel of it and so I went online and I googled sheds and I saw the shed that I wanted and that led me to you. So this is where it started. At this point we were making sure that the offset was proper and we you know were far enough away from uh, the fences. So the foundation went in, they came in really clean, set up their little workstation over here for their tools. There was our shed right there and our permits. And then this was the end of day one. We were completely watertight. It was so impressive. And the guys were so clean and neat. And here we were, this is the beginning of day two. And this is by the end of day two. It was just, it was incredible. And then I brought my furniture in and made it my home, my home away from home. It's a great space. I love it here. I have my computer and all of my projects are here. And this is completely my space. And my husband and I text back and forth to each other to talk and all hours of the night and and I have my garden so it's just my home away from home.